We're at Huntington Beach High School's theater. For years, George has been rumored to haunt the theater. The story goes that the janitor walked in the room and he found George's body hanging above the stage. There's a tunnel that goes down to City Hall. It's creepy. I watched it. Went like that, and then that triggered. George, I want to see it go to blue. <gasps> I went to this high school. I was in the theater department. It was spirits coming up from the ground. Yeah, this is where someone has gotten buried. Is anyone in this room with us? This one's always in this room. This room is just death. There's some places that are dark. This place holds them here. I can't protect you. <gasps> do you think it's something bad in here? Yeah, I do. I'm nauseous. My head hurts. I definitely feel so. The ghost light is to ward off the spirits. We gotta unplug the ghost light. We said that it's what keeps the spirits away. It's not what we want. Three, two, one. Listen to our backpack right now. <gasps> Beer box, box just turned on. on by itself. What's up you guys? Welcome back to our channel. If you're new here, we're Mackie and Amanda. I'm Mackie. I'm Amanda. And we're the Spooky Booze. I'm super excited for tonight's location. It's somewhere we've tried to get in for a while. Has some ties to Huntington Beach's history in general, but to the Newland House. Mrs. Newland actually donated funds to help build this place. We're at Huntington Beach High School's theater. For years and years, basically since the beginning of time, they have rumored that this place is haunted by a specific spirit named George. George has been rumored to haunt the theater so severely that even to this day, they have a whole protocol they go through before every show to make sure that George doesn't get upset and ruin something. So they actually have a show here coming up and tonight we're super excited to go in and investigate, see why George haunts this place, why he stays there, and why he torments the cast of these productions. If you wanna come see a show in this theater that we're about to investigate, check the link in our description because they have some really cool shows coming up. On that note, I say we head in there ourselves and investigate. All right, let's go. It's a tradition in theater to have a ghost light. And the ghost light is to always have a light on in the room so if anyone walks in they can see, but also to ward off evil spirits. We really? That's is that in every theater? Or just every here? Theater is a ghost light. Who knew? Not me. Not me either. I'm Jillian. I'm Emily. And I'm Katie. We're all part of the APA technical theater program. Me and Katie both like ghosts a lot. So we tried to find out who George really was. We were told the story as freshmen, um, as all APA freshmen are. And so we took it upon ourselves over the summer to kind of go into the archives of the Huntington Beach High School yearbooks and look and see if we could find out anything else about George and about his story. We started at the Hunt Huntington Beach Public Library and we were looking in the yearbooks and we're, we requested the years 28. 8 through 34. Mm -hmm. And they came back and they gave us 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, and 34. Wait, from the 1900s, yes. right? Oh my they god. Have all of them in from the 1900s. <laughs> <laughs> I just gotta clarify. Wait, but one was missing? Yes. <gasps> so 1933 was missing. That so, would have been the year that he would have died? Yes. Okay. So because no. Because way. Yes. So we did some digging and we found the year 1933. Why there wasn't a yearbook that year is because it was like around the time of the Great Depression and they didn't have enough money to do uh, it. There was no yearbook published that year. And then we also found another newspaper article about yes. a George and I think one other boy and then the and what we think is the, the girlfriend, girlfriend in a newspaper article being that they were in a play. Yes, they were in a play. It was the junior play in 1932, which were like a one act kind of thing. Yeah. So it was mm. written by so the students. So it could have very well students. been a Shakespeare. Yes. Romeo and However, he, it, it said that he died 
during Romeo and Juliet. So Juliet. we're assuming that that would have been the show from 33. Yeah. That um, article that we found was just one of the shows that proved that he really was who we found. And then we looked back in the yearbooks from his freshman, sophomore, junior year, because he would have died his senior year. And we were able to find pictures of him <gasps> and the suspected girlfriend. You you guys found the pictures? We think, yeah. Do you have them? Yeah. The story goes that George and his girlfriend were auditioning for the play Romeo and Juliet. And then when the cast list came out, George did not get cast and the girlfriend was cast as Juliet. So over the course of the show, the girlfriend started to fall in love with the, with the guy that played Romeo. Worst thing that could possibly happen if you're George, right? The story goes that the janitor was here in the auditorium cleaning on the night of final dress rehearsal, and he locked all the doors and went home that night. But when he came back the next morning, he unlocked the doors and he walked in the room and he found George's body hanging above the stage. Oh my God. And so then, ever since then, there's been ghost stories about him. Because I remember, even when I was like little, hearing that the theater here was haunted, but I never knew like all the details of it. Yeah. yeah. So now there's tons of stories that go around. People are always being haunted by George. Everyone's like, "Oh, this happened to me. I'm sure it was George. Oh, this happened over here. I'm sure it was him." Uh, and we keep a noose hanging above our room. Uh, out of respect. Yes. Oh, we can walk up the stage. Yes. Yeah. The other thing we do, so yes. one of the traditions that we have is the entire cast and crew for the main stage musicals and plays will sign the opening night show bill in honor. And there was a show that I was a sophomore, or a sophomore here. There was a show that there were two cast members that did not sign. And oh, no. some things that wrote on opening oh. night, and it was kind of a fun opening weekend. So um, after that, everyone kind of went, oh, it rains true. What year was that? It was 2014. Oh, my God. Oh, what the the <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. That was Where? Oh, right there. It's down. That's like someone's that. sitting there. That was down. Wait, wait, wait. Amanda. Just to see it. Does it hurt? What? Like, the? So 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 but yeah. that was up before. Yeah. What? That was really sad. That's a little sus. With, with that, I can tell a story that happened to me. Okay. Oh, wait, literally, I'm so sorry. No other chair is down. Literally, just one. You volunteered. Okay, so I'm gonna leave it down and see if he does it throughout the night. So story on that, now that it's down, okay. freaking us all out. Uh, my freshman year, I was here late, it was probably eight or nine o'clock, and we were doing a lighting hang. So I could see every person that was in the theater with me, they were all on stage and I could count heads. I could see every single person I knew was here. And I'm sitting at the lighting console up in the balcony, and all of a sudden from behind me, because there's chairs that back the lighting console. Did that. <gasps> and I was like, I'm not with this right now. Do people ever see like shadows or anything? Or is it more just like, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I, the basement. Yeah, the basement's kind of freaky. There's a basement? There's yeah. a basement there's below basement here. Basement. And we've had like yeah, the crazy the basement, stuff. Basement, yeah. We heard like noises. We were alone down there. It sounded oh, like a big see. metal went like, like really loud. A lot of things happened my freshman year that really, because I never believed in ghosts uh -huh. until I came to Appa and I was like, okay. Just kidding, I really believe in ghosts. <laughs> so I was standing on the third level of our shop putting something away and one of our upperclassmen flipped the lights off, not knowing I was up there because mm -hmm. it was late and we were leaving. And I swear I saw a shadow about this distance from me to you. And I was like, please turn the lights back on. And yeah. I like bolted. This already seems intense with the chair being down and just waiting for it to flip up any <laughs> second. Like, I know. I <laughs> know. Down. Turn off the lights. The basement's the creepiest because there's this like big steel door and then there's a tunnel that goes down to City Hall. What? It's creepy. It's what? Super How far is City yeah. Hall from here as someone who doesn't live in Huntington yeah. Beach? Okay. Yeah. But like, is it still open, the tunnel? Yeah. No.
Is it still open, the tunnel? Yeah. No, no, it doesn't. Oh, it's not. oh okay. <laughs> Aww. There is a tunnel down there in yeah. the old joke, but I think it probably did exist at one point in time as you couldn't get from here over there. Okay. But I don't think you can anymore. The news sure. is right up there, though. Yeah. It's right behind oh, the oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, is that where he was hanging? Or was no, I no. think he was hanging in the street. Yeah. Don't. Oh, it's okay. We've seen worse. This is so crazy. Yeah. We're off. Ooh, it's getting toasty down here. Oh, God. Oh, oh my God. Holy. We don't know, like... Oh! oh well, apparently there was a time where someone found a diamond down there. What? Rumor has it. I'm in. Oh my god, Amanda. That's dark. It's at the end. Oh no, I can't see. Oh, just... <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Sorry, I mean, I scared myself. <laughs> Stand up straight.
Yes. Huge thing, yeah. yeah. When we were down here, she had an experience where we had a chandelier down there, and then all of a sudden it completely shifted <gasps> on its own. And nothing oh. was around there. Oh, was the chandelier still there? Yeah, I put oh. like, all the chandeliers yeah. on. It was on the ground. It was so much messier before. Was that was no. That's, that That's crazy. <gasps> Dude, it's not locked. <laughs> oh, it's not? No. I didn't even know that even opened. Wait, I've never seen it before. I don't want to the know. haunted mirror is in here? No, the haunted mirror is not in here. But, oh, there's. Oh my god, why is that little lamp on? Dude, how far have you ever been? Yeah, I'm like, I don't want that door shut. Yeah, I saw it. They must have kept it unlocked by accident. Oh, I wasn't going to tell the story, but the summer of my. Right before my sophomore year. Of course, um, freshman year still. <laughs> right, still freshman year. I was in here and Joe was walking around one of his, I want to say, I don't know who she was and I'd never seen her before and I never saw her after this, but we were actually in here and I walked by and asked Joe a question. He was like, oh, let me introduce you to so-and-so. We had a conversation and then she looked at Joe, she's like, hey, you know who she looks like? Joe goes, no, and she goes, she looks like George's girlfriend. And I was like, <gasps> Okay, please tell me you're like just trying to scare the freshmen because like Joe introduced me as the freshman. Yeah. And that's kind of what sent me on this like ghost hunt to find George and the girlfriend because I wanted to know if that was true. And uh, we did find her and I do very much look like her. Oh like, my God. I was gonna ask earlier when you were telling us about all the experiences that you've had, if you think that there's a reason they're so attracted yeah, to you. Yeah, I do. <laughs> and I already call it that, so. Holy crap. That's crazy. Do you see you found a picture of her too? It was creepy because I'm looking in these yearbooks and all of a sudden Jill goes, hey, look at this. And I was like, you must be messing with me. Like, please tell me you're messing with me because I didn't want to believe that I looked like her. Because that's just a crazy story and a crazy happening. Uh, especially considering we land here, same place, about 100 years apart. That's so. crazy. Yeah, and then I looked into her after we found her and um, she died a couple months before I was born. <gasps> I was just going to ask. Stop. You reincarnated. That's my story, and I wasn't gonna tell it because it's really out there. But no, that's that is my story. What about you? What have you have you seen or felt anyone? Amanda's a medium, and so that's why I'm asking if she felt anyone. It definitely just seems like we're being watched. Like that's kind of what it feels like to me. You know, yeah. I was like, what are you doing here? Oh wait, do you find it? This is the one that kind of, I mean, Ooh, it was like an old lady uh -huh. said, yeah. so. Yeah. Wait, and this is the one that was the George's girlfriend, girl yeah. Oh. Or the one that was gonna play. Okay, oh, that's actually God. like crazy. <laughs> that is, and then this is the one X, the four one X plays. I can send you all these. Oh, yeah, that'd be amazing. Please. Oh, do you hear that? Yes. <laughs> I'm kind of tempted to turn off the ghost light. Mm. Have you guys ever turned it off? We, we take it out of the shows and stuff, but not uh, yeah. when all the lights are off. No. Wait, are you guys able to go up there to that top room? That's a spot there. We can go up there. That's a creepy place. Is it? it is. So right now we're going to start at the top. Wait, this looks creepy too. This whole place is <laughs> messed up. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay. I'm just going. I'm going. This is okay. Um, is it normal for the bathroom door to open on its own? No. That well, is not. It just, it just opened. Wait, no, no. It's never been opened. It just, it just opened by itself. Like, you can probably wait, hear it on camera. This is okay. Um, open it real quick. The lights will go on when you go there. Okay. Hello? Is anyone in here? Did you hear it tap? I did. Oh. It sounds like tapping. Feels like my high school again. <laughs> the backpack in the girls' room. All right, that was very weird, but moving on. This is the main one. Oh, okay, this is where we came first. Oh, 
or two. Do you want back yeah. <gasps> Let me in, Bob. They're coming for me. Oh. 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 Do you hear that? Yeah, wait. Hello? Sound like someone opened a door down there. Just watch me step in there like yeah, weird stairs. stairs. Holy oh, sh so weird. Oh god, I just got the coldest breeze. Holy shit. Holy I can tell the gust of cold. Hi. Hi. It's hard to breathe in here. My name is Amanda. I'm Mackie. You're not gonna touch anything or ruin the show. Whew. Oh. Oh my god. As soon as you turned around, I felt like they dipped. Really? Who is that George? Yeah. Hey George. Can you give us a knock or something? Can you just assure him that you're not gonna touch anything? Oh. Or I won't touch anything. I'll get away from everything right now. Oh. Thank you, George. See, that was like what you needed yeah. to do for him to knock. Yeah. That was crazy. Well, yeah. my name's Mackie. My name's Amanda. We have some of the APA students showing us around tonight. Definitely seen us walking all around the stage, but we've landed in this room. We know you tried out for on stage, but the light room is a little creepy, we can all agree. So we brought some equipment with us to communicate with you. Is that something you're willing to do, George? Did you hear that? Yeah. It sounded like uh, Yeah. But like it, it sounded like a word, but it sounded like a word. We're just here to hear your story. We know a lot of people have talked about you for years and years and years. But we want to hear it from you. Are you open to that? Are you open to that? Are you open to that? Give us a knock if you are. I heard yes. Yeah. He's in that corner over there making noise. Do you see him over there? No, I just feel him because I'm not yeah. facing that way. Yeah. So. Feeling because I'm not yeah. facing that way. Yeah. Feeling because I'm not yeah. facing that way. Yeah. Oh my god, there's a freaking creepy chair. Oh, it can you see when he's set this on here? Oh, it can you see when he's set? Oh, it can you see when he's set? Oh, it can you see when he's set this on here? Uh, yeah. Is he okay with that? Yeah, he is. Okay. What? Did you hear that? There's a guy's voice in like, yeah. I did hear that. I'm gonna come over here just to take a look. Are you in this chair? Can you move it a little bit if you are? Did you just sigh, Amanda? No, not at all. Okay, then it's definitely George over here. All right, we're gonna set some up, set up some of our stuff for you. <laughs> Why not? Did you hit the capital? No. I didn't think you did. 
was that? What I the f oh my gosh, I did not No, no, no. I this went like this, man, to watch. I watched it. Went like that, and then that triggered. You'll probably like this, George. It's called a REM pod. It's a type of equipment. It does just that. I think it's calibrating right now. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> Okay, can you make that stop, please? Okay. <gasps> so that's exactly what you did, the best way to communicate with us, along with our other devices. If you're... Close the door. Just your face when I turn around. It's praying. It sounds like something's dragging up here. 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 Now we have two devices set up in this corner where you were hanging out. There's this pink flashlight right here. Can you go up and tap it? Put energy into it and it'll turn on. Do you still feel them in here? I feel like he left when we came over here. But what? yeah, he's Sh here still. Should we back up to that end? Maybe he'll come back over to the sun. It's hard to breathe. It is. It makes me think of how he hung himself. The fuck? <gasps> the flashlight turned on. George, would you be able to set off that device we placed in the chair with the red dot on it? Or turn that flashlight back off. I feel like it's very difficult for him. Okay. I don't know why. Oh my god. Off. Okay. Did you not hear that? No, I did. It sounded like a footstep, right? On the stairs. I see we tried the dressing room. Yeah. Alright, George, we're going to the dressing room. How do you feel about that, George? George, wait, we're gonna ask you one question. Girls or boys dressing room? Can you turn on the flashlight for the boys dressing room? <gasps> Holy <laughs> shit. All right, boys it is. All right, we're headed there, George. Boys rule, girls drool. Girls go to Mars to get more. All right, don't fall down, Bo. <laughs> Hello. How was that? Very weird. It was Sorry. cool. <laughs> Mackie? <gasps> Shut up. That's actually crazy. Your dad? <laughs> Your dad. That's your dad? That's your dad. <laughs> That's my dad. That's your dad. Go stand next to him in the same position. <laughs> That's so funny. Wait, the little smile. Oh my god, it's opening. Is that open? Yeah. The first time when we were walking I, through the store, that. we heard it open. Oh. Um, did you guys shut it when you guys Yeah, we, we did. Shut it. Let's get out of here. Continue on. Right when I walked in here. Shut up. Hello, coming in. I wonder if these lights turn. They definitely do. Shut that door. Is it? Did you not hear that? I did actually. <gasps> oh my god. Just I want to show that there's no one else here. Whoa. Was that not you? No. George. Can you knock again like that? The last one was three times. Oh, oh my god. Okay, maybe that was 
Oh, the light flicking off. That was the light. in here George if that was you knocking in there can you do it again the silence is deafening <laughs> <laughs> did you not hear that shut the f up did you not just hear that that was so loud <laughs> <laughs> I heard whispers right when you knocked. Really? Is it okay if I come in and set this down? Yes. George, I want to see it go to blue. Alright, George, can you walk up to that red light? <gasps> Good job, George. Purple, can you do purple, George? Put a little bit more power in there. Take energy from our light. Purple, it's right after blue. I'm gonna ask something else, I'm so sorry. George, can you grab that antenna? Can you grab that stick? That metal stick sticking out of that red device that you're near. Grab it with all your might. <gasps> there was just a shadow out there. I swear to God. The second it stopped, there was a shadow that walked by it. It cut off the light. That gave me such chills. Okay. But the way it just stopped. All right, George, this little device I'm holding, there will be words and sounds and if you have anything to say. George, I want to know if the story is true. That's one of my biggest questions is how much truth to that story is there. Perfect. Is it true, George? Don't step towards it or it'll stop. That was not normal. That was crazy. It went for so long. Oh, sorry, that was me. The, the ch children play games. <gasps> he plays games. He does. He does. He does. That's what he's most known for. Yeah, he plays games, plays tricks on the kids uh, at the school here and are part of the program. So we know your hauntings are true, but we kind of knew that from our own experiences and all of the stories from everyone who stayed here, to articles online, everything. George, we know that your story is true. I'm alone here. This is so crazy. The fact that this freaking yearbook that year is in there. I swear, it's like a Pretty Little Liars that we're living in right It's now. Pretty Little I Liars. Swear to God. You're hilarious. <laughs> Tell us anything about your passing. Anything about your death? Did it happen here? What? The bathroom again. Albert. Albert. Did you hear that behind you too? Yes. That's like, uh. Oh, no. You yeah. hit it. Okay, what the fuck? What is happening in here? Albert. Albert. George, Albert, whoever's talking in here. Can you please set off this little red dot we have on the ground? Just go up to it. It'll light up, make noise if you can. Oh. Or give us what? It keeps knocking. Can you give us one big knock? That was 
like banging on Can you do that again? One more time. This is the last time I'll ask. We're friends. <gasps> I'm, I'm an Albert. Hey guys, we're glowing. Oh my, why does that always happen to me in every picture we take? What is this? I don't know, an anomaly. Is there a reason you wanted us to come in this room, into the dressing room? He's Are you recording? Yes, yes, we are. Is there something you want to do? Stop the recording right now. Stop the recording. A tap. Is there an issue with us recording? I was going to say there's a woman here. Literally two seconds her ago. Voice. Her voice. It just said her voice. Did you hear a ringing in your ear too? Yes. Like so, yes, so high pitched. Yeah, I feel like she's here and she's out. She's not in the dressing room. <sighs> I know this is pretty risky of us to even come in here. Is there anywhere else that you want us to go tonight? Gail. Gail. The, the woman. Gail. All right, we're gonna head out of here unless... Should we go to the girls' dressing room and just peek in? Yeah. Is there anything else you want? Scary. Scary. Scary girls. We're gonna grab our stuff and head into the next room. Please join us. Again, you can tell us throughout the night if there's anywhere else you think that we should go. Anywhere that you're hanging out that you want us to head to. Alright. What? What? Stop the camera. Stop the camera. What the fuck? What the fuck? I asked if we were recording and then I told us to stop the camera. Stop the camera. No. Oh my god, the girls have it so much bigger. Holy. Is there anyone in here with us? I'm listening to everything. What the fuck? That's fine, you can listen. You can come along with us all night. How's it feeling here to you? Um, like the same thing as followed us in here, so. Really? So he's yeah. just following us around? So if you go anywhere, yeah. Negative. Negative. Should we go in that room in the basement, like the secluded one? That's usually locked. They said it's always locked. It's never open. It's almost like there's a reason. Yeah. Let's pop off the lights and see. Okay. Okay, what the fuck? Who's in here with us? Many died here. Many died here? My neck is stinging. It's all us with the neck. Is there any red marks anywhere? It's like in this area. Like anywhere around here. No, it looks totally fine actually. Okay. It's just like a sting. All right, we're gonna leave now. Unless anybody has something that they want to say. Late. Late? The person we're meeting here is late. She is late. No shade. Yeah, no it's shade. Like it's fine. No shade. No shade. Okay. Maybe they're talking about Sheena. Maybe she, he probably knows Sheena. Because Sheena she, went to school here, everyone. She was part of the APA program and she was the award winner for her year that she was in APA. Do you know the lady that's coming to meet us? Is that who you're talking about? She's here, she just texted. Oh my gosh, okay. All right, we're gonna go get her. Agitated. Agitated. The last two things, negative and agitated. agitated. Why is he getting upset? Light turned off, I saw it in this reflection, and then it turned back on. What the f? There's something fishy something, going on in there. Something's in there, for sure. Do you Albert, think I think Albert hangs out in there, and I think George is the one who falls. <gasps> Light! <laughs> no! Show that! Lights! I'm shaking. This is insane. Alright, let's get Sheena and figure out what the hell is going on in the school. You guys have seen Sheena in multiple of our videos and lives, and this place, you have a special connection to yourself. I do, I went to this high school, I was in the theater department, I was the thespian president, and uh, I haven't been here since 1986 when I came back to 
award an award to somebody that I won my senior year in 1985. Have you ever had any first-hand experiences with George? From the minute I got here. When I was in school here, they used to send us up to this costume loft, which is no longer the costume loft. The first time I went up there, I was on the first level, and something from the third level started throwing costumes down <gasps> on my head. And I was on one of those ladders that you have to like walk yeah. up, and I was terrified. So then I went back in there again to give it a second try, and I was up on that ladder again, and I heard, hey, what are you doing? And I turned around, and there was nobody there. Oh my and that God. was it. No more for me. I wouldn't go up there anymore. So things always happened here. You'd be going on stage, and you'd feel someone shove you. <gasps> Somebody would trip you when you were on stage. I mean, crazy things would happen here the entire time. And we all knew that it was spirits. It was spirits coming up from the ground oh. because that's Huntington Beach, and they live here all the time. Right. Glad to be here with you both. Glad to have you. And if you guys want to contact Sheena, yeah. 818-437-0886. I give my number out on Mackie and Amanda shows and you all text me and I love that. It'll be in the description too, but hit her up. Hit now, me up, I love it. <laughs> now hit let's get up. started. I bring a lot of water, it keeps the demons away. <laughs> <laughs> She's not kidding. Did you ever go in the basement when you went to school here? Oh, I'm sure. Wait, 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 wait. What is say? Where are my ashes? Some of these ashes are here. Some of these ashes are here. Some of these ashes are here. Doesn't surprise me at all. Where are my ashes and my bodies around here? What is going on? Do you think it's George? I think it's a lot of people, but I definitely think it's George. He's always been tormented. They have a noose hanging up here. Oh, we always had that. Oh my. Like I'm more than happy to go in the room alone with the spirit box and you're on the other side of the wall. That would be sick. That would be sick. Attack. I had to go <gasps> after that. Attack? Are you gonna attack one of us? We go in that room? <laughs> goodbye. I just said goodbye. <sighs> Not yet, George. Not yet, Shit, George. Not done yet, George. Okay, how is that? What did it say, Mackie? The second I stepped in there, said, I lost my life here. Yeah, somebody's buried under here. Oh, because she was saying that. Some of the tunnels were used as bunkers. <gasps> oh, so, oh, during. Right when you get here. Yeah. Holy sh. Yeah, just wait. Look at this room. No, right here is where that wall was seal sealed off. Oh, oh no. Yeah, this is where someone has gotten buried. From before the school was built. <sighs> like this one bricked off room, or this one total separate room, the tunnel runs behind it. Yeah, right behind it. Is anyone in this room with us? This one's always in this room. Someone's always in this room? Oh, yeah. So many people live in here. It's like they're just stacked up. Someone's always in here. Can you give us a sign? There's a younger person that's stepping forward. I'm gonna stay right here. Okay. Because I feel like I can't breathe down here. Yeah, it's pretty bad. So many unhappy souls. So many of them just gathering down here. This room is just death. I feel like people who came back from World War I yeah. Some of their souls are here. Can you tell us the year that you passed away? It's like 1917. Came right back to high school after dying in the war. Julia. Julia. It's like who they came back for? Yeah. yeah. Why don't you leave this room? I don't feel like they're bound here. No. They, I feel like they like it. It's dark. The earth holds them here. It's is dark. that what it is? Yeah. dark. It's a Huntington Beach thing. There's some places that are dark. Really? And this place holds them here. Nancy. Multiple girl names. Girlfriends they came back for. Oh. I just sit out here so I can breathe. Okay. Is anyone in here that is open to communicating with us? Can you make a noise if you are?
How do you feel about this light being on? Sheena said that you stay here because you like the dark. And that's why you're bound to this place. But when we came in, the light was on. It's gotta be Sheena. No f***ing way. Sheena, was that you? Oh, you're fucking kidding me. You're fucking kidding me. You're fucking kidding me. Did you hear me? I just put my phone in the eye. I asked for a noise. It made a noise. And that we was... were like, we, and we were like, nah, that wasn't uh, it. Like, did you hear me? Yeah, we heard you. Are you okay if we turn off this light? It's not supposed to go off. Alice. Alice. Another name. Why are they all girls' names? Alright, I'm turning this off. I don't want to turn this off just to see how dark it is. I just feel like I'm Because this is going to be pitch dark. I can't protect you. <gasps> I can't protect you. I feel like we should make it pitch dark in here and then that says I can't protect you. And something up there said it was gonna hurt us. Yeah. Do you want to attack? Something said attack us. Oh my god. What do we need to be protected from? What was born in the darkness? Raised in it. Oh, it's raised in it. Okay, what corner do you think it'd be in? More like towards the. Over there. Yeah, closer to the tunnel. Careful you again. Look up. You went like this one. I came from a dark place. I was I born came in from a dark place. I was born in the darkness. It's gonna catch things walking through the tunnel. Are you serious? Yeah, if there wasn't that wall there. I can see him walking like through the wall. Like I don't even know how to describe that. I just can see the shadows going by. Okay, what is it? No way. I said I was born in the darkness. You said raised in it. I came from a dark place. If you walk, she pushed. She pushed. If you walk in front of this, oh. what? I what? just pushed the music box. <gasps> This is a music box. If you step it in front of it, it will play music. Sure. Okay. Just like this. Just Can like you this. follow Mackie's lead? I'm, I'm so sorry. Watch it. Watch it. You stepped into someone. Watch it. I literally stepped up this and like did that. Can you, here, can you follow me? Can you follow me right here? It's speeding up. Something touched, something touched my finger. So much so that I jerked the camera. Give me five seconds to make it stop. Oh, I got the whole pull in my hair. Right here. <gasps> That's exactly where I felt it last time, in the very, very beginning. Oh my god. That's calibrating. It's fearful. It's gonna keep going off. Fearful. Much, much less. Is there, are you George? No. George doesn't come in here. Do you think it's something bad in here? Yeah, I do. I think it's multiple things. But not, not all of them are bad. It feels very earthly. You know how there's like almost separate things like- Yeah. I feel like there's definitely spirits here also, but what's here is like mainly, and what we need to be afraid of, earthbound. Oh. Like earth, spirits of the earth, like, uh -huh. do you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Demand. Demand. Do you have a demand you're trying to make? Is there, like, what's your demand? Who keeps setting off this music box? Stops. I know. Hi, everyone. That's creepy. Hello. I'm starting to get a headache in here. I don't know about you. I said we get out. All right. All right. We're going to go upstairs to the stage. Do you want to come with us? Stop. Oh, fuck. 
Yeah. Two, three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you come with us? No. They don't want to. No need. Alright, I'm going But they're like, you go. Alright, we're gonna go then. One thing, it was like, wait. But I don't think we should wait. Okay. I'm starting to feel nauseous too. I feel like that one thing that was like, wait, is the one thing that's affecting us. The fact that there's like a million like hand prints and like she died. She died. Today I am a muff. <laughs> she then just texted the spirit letter upstairs. I just got really scared that someone was gonna lock us in here. Because now we're alone. Shut up. What? Battle. Battle? Battle. Alright, we're out of here. Yeah, there's definitely something heavy in here. I'm nauseous, my head hurts, my back hurts. I definitely feel something just touch my elbow. I definitely feel I definitely feel something just touch my elbow. Let's go. We brushed it. Go, 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 go. So what happened to you? So I just felt like I couldn't breathe. There's all these oh, yeah. spirits of people that party down there. It's funny because when I was in school, I didn't even know that existed down there. Nobody ever talked about down there. I never even knew it was a thing. Way before I was here, there were people that went down there and had parties. Mm -hmm. You know, the school was built in 1905. Okay. So okay. you can feel it behind the walls, the stuff that's really old that's still here. So if someone brought you up here? Yeah. The spirit? Yeah, I follow the spirit out here. Do you think he wants to go out on the stage? She's kind of by the door there. Just standing there being so nice while I talk to these girls. Let's go. The moment we've all been waiting for. Oh. When did it hit you the minute you walked out here? I was gonna say the same thing. It hasn't changed in almost 40 years. It's the same thing. I feel like we've got to do something to get these spirits talking. I think we gotta unplug the ghost light. I feel like everything has led to this part. I know. They said that it's what keeps the spirits away. And obviously, it's not what we want. Yeah. It is. <laughs> the ghost light's going off. Three, two, one. Oh my god. Whoa, shut the fuck up. What? Listen to our backpack right now. <gasps> Our, sp our spirit, spirit box, box just turned on. on by itself. I felt that same thing. Oh my gosh. It turned itself on. It was in the front pocket that doesn't touch anything. It's so much darker in here. Lady that I followed up from downstairs, she was like this, which is always creepy. And then when I got to the room, back here to the theater room she was like this like don't go to the auditorium she had a like a victorian gown on what the school wasn't really here then so i'm thinking she was in a play oh. <gasps> and there's temperature the temperature we didn't even have temperature on my back is freezing they are all over me you know what's so weird is that when i was a teenager and i didn't know about my gifts I had such a horrible anxiety for four years when I was here. Never like that again. And everybody, oh, you're a teenager. I'm wondering if it was this place. I believe oh. it was the spirits that gave me that feeling of dread every time I came here. Now, when I was performing, I was fine. It wasn't like stage fright. But every time, even if I was just here during the day when we were rehearsing, like in my solar plexus chakra, like I had to like carry a bottle of ginger ale with me everywhere because you never knew when. Because I have that feeling again right now and I think it's this place. <laughs> Interesting. Oh let's set some stuff up and ask some questions. Yeah, let's start yeah. asking some questions. Okay. Oh. That's where the noose is hanging yeah. is that side too. Yep. But there's more than joints here. I mean, yeah, the absolutely. Beach, like I was saying downstairs, Huntington Beach, there's an energy. There's Earth spirits, they're exploding in the ground. Wait, what is the last word you just said? Earth spirits? Oh my god. She was upstairs. Yes, she was. When we were in that room down below, Amanda was like, whatever's in here is making me nervous. It's like a different type of spirit. It's like Earth spirits. There you go. That's what's here.
here. I've never said that word no, before, I, Sheena. I think that's why she lured me up because I started feeling like something was not going to be right in my body. And even when I tried to sit just in the prop area, uh -huh. it was still like so oppressive. Plus that prop area has all that stuff that's been donated to the school. Yeah. yeah. Owned and stuff from estate sales and dead people yeah. touched it. I mean, it's, it's insane. That feeling is exactly what drew us up here. You can feel spirits rising up out of the ground and crazy and i don't know about you Matthew, but i feel that when i'm in my house i can feel them at night walking around the house oh. and my cat will sit there like this in the screen door i mean just like at night like how many things could be out there that i couldn't see yeah, yeah. oh my gosh feel that in like the kitchen and living room area and garage at night in my house yep like it's especially walking down the hallway the lights off it's like oh my god someone's behind me they're gonna catch me <gasps> set her up <laughs> why, why, why am i doing all this weird stuff tonight you're acting out for sure exactly. you're becoming a theater right man. that's exactly what we said i started singing but like in a theater manner I'm like we're on the road we're on the road and i never <laughs> do that it's them it's so weird what? There's someone tapping over here. There's somebody sitting right there in the first room of the balcony. I've seen that all night. Balcony. Balcony. There's a figure. There's a man sitting there. Who is that? He says, this is my auditorium. And you can stay as long as I'll let you. Well, sir, we only need a little bit longer. Music box. Rempod in the middle of the stage like you thought. Do you think it's worth it to put anything under the news? It could be. Probably not the music box though. Can we make that stop please? We want to ask you some questions, but we want to set some other stuff up first. So can you please make that stop until we're ready? That's intense. The way it just keeps going on. You guys, come on. I'm gonna restart it then. You know you're here. There was multiple people on stage behind you when you were over there. Mm hmm I could see them. I would try and get as much, I would set it right where you are. And Is it okay that someone's been pulling my hair for the last five minutes? We've experienced that all night. And I'm just letting them. <coughs> Do you want to turn on the thing on your phone again, just to have it on in the background? <coughs> what the fuck? <coughs> that throat chakra. Throat chakra. Do you need some water? It feels like I'm choking on something. The stories of this place. Yeah, it's weird. They're trying to shut you down. I'm gonna turn this on too because the spirits obviously wanted it on. Oh. What? There's the news right there. Cat ball right here. Bro, bro. What? Wait, what the f is it doing? What is it doing? Please move back. What? What? Hold on. That is crazy. Holy sh! Do I dare? You, I think yes. you do. We occupy this land. We, we occupy, occupy this land. Oh my god. Okay, this is. Okay, this is the scariest thing I've encountered in a long time. George and the spirits of the theater. We've set up devices along your stage. We have a REM pod, which is a red light. This isn't even on. Oh, this isn't even oh it's on. not on. On. We only have a few minutes before we leave this place. So if there's anything that you want us to know. I said that downstairs. What? I was like, it's almost like it's a giant. Wait, wait, what? There's a man upstairs. Are you feet tall? Solid black. Solid black shadow face. Dark, dark entity here. Hey, wait, no. I swear. 
I swear. Who's the dark entity? Stop. He said stop. And Sheena said he's counting the minutes until we leave. Go. Do you go. want us to leave? Okay, you've already asked. Do you want to make, make you? It's a make you. We will leave right now if you set off any of our devices we have placed on the stage. Ooh. Do you hear that? Yeah, it was so loud on the left. My body hurts. They don't want us here anymore. Take a picture. Take a, Take a picture. Do you have your phone? I do. Of the stage or of the audience? Oh my gosh, look at this. Yeah. It stopped. I swear there were so many. Oh my god. Mackie, it said your name. Wait. What do you want from me? I'm listening. Where do you want me to go? What? I see something. Concern. No, right here there's nothing. Uh huh. <gasps> but on that side there totally what? is. Do you see it? Yes. That's weird. That's really weird. Are you sitting in that chair right there? That's where his chair is. Okay, it's gone. Oh. I'm here. Me. Robinson. 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 Or go to blue. You go blue. It's not gonna go to blue. That was the thing in the downstairs. What about yellow? Okay, it's off. Is there anything you want to share? Is there anything you want to tell us? There's bad here. There's bad here. There's bad here. All right. I have a, one more question. Do you recognize Sheena? So, I thought it said high school something. Well, thank you for letting us come to your theater. Thank you for interacting with us tonight. Is there anything else you want us to know before we leave? What? Do you think they're just done with us? Yeah, beyond. Alright, I'm going to plug... I'm going to plug in your light. Don't be fearful. Don't be fearful. Okay. All right, Thanks. there's your light. I'm turning this off. Goodbye.